Introducing Filmora, 12 beta version. First one is the interface design, wherein you can see here the aspect ratio and you can change it to your preferred ratio just like the camera and the default one. Also, you can use the instant mode, the screen recorder, the auto reframe, instant cutter, the silence detection, and auto beat sync. You can also use the cloud project but I don't use this one. So let's go to the creator hub wherein you can explore fun and useful video creation guidelines. In this section of the Filmora, which is the creator hub, you can see different videos that you can use as your guide to make your video more creative. So let's try the instant mode. Using instant mode, there are numerous number of templates that you can use in order to make your video, just like this one. There are different kinds of categories to choose from, just like the business, travel, education, family, holiday, birthday, and love. The templates that you will be using will depend on you. So better explore and try these different kinds of templates and unleash your creativity. The second one is the workspace layouts wherein we can change the layout of the workspace. For you to change the layout, you will find the logo of the layout mode on the upper side of this screen. So you will click on it and then you will choose on the different layouts such as the organize, this one. Second is the default. Third one is the short videos. This layout is good for YouTube shorts, especially to those influencers or YouTubers that are fond of making short videos or reels on Facebook. Fourth one is the classic. I think this is the original version of the Filmora workspace before. And the exciting part is that they also have the dual. So if you have dual monitor, you can use that layout in order for you to edit more easily. The third one is the keyboard shortcuts. For us to find it, you will click the file, file tab, and you will find keyboard shortcuts. Also use the CTRLC for you to directly found the keyboard shortcuts but they also have this logo and you will just click on it and then find the keyboard shortcuts then you can customize the controls of your keyboard depending on you just like this one I'll be trying to change the keyboard shortcut for new project. So let's try Shift C and that's it. I've already changed the shortcut for new project. Also you can reset it if you don't want to change it anymore. So I've reset it because I don't usually use keyboard shortcuts. One advantage of keyboard shortcuts is for beginners for them to edit more easily and faster. Fourth one is the AI Smart Cat Out. With this one, you can use this if you want to remove the background of the video or picture.
just find the AI tools and then click the video. So I'll be using the brush in order to select the part that I don't want to be removed. Just like this animal. You don't need to brush all the part of the picture or the video. Just the border. Just like what I did. On the older version of Filmora, there is no smart cut. To finish up this video, I am inviting you guys to join and share the hashtag Filmora Club Impression to win more prizes. Filmora gave us 4 hints that we should always remember, which are the efficiency, freedom, creativity, and inspiration.